Germany is a key partner of Kazakhstan in Europe, said President of Kazakhstan Qasem Jomar Tokayev in an interview to German broadcaster Deutsche Welle. Kazakhstan accounts for 86% of Germany's total trade with Central Asia. The main share of investments is focused on non-raw materials sector. The President of Kazakhstan highlighted that the visit to Germany will expand economic relations. A number of agreements and memorandums are expected to be signed in Berlin. Германия является мировым лидером в области машиностроения, обработки ресурсных материалов и так далее. Germany is a world leader in mechanical engineering, processing of resource materials and others. Therefore, we are interested in partnering with this country in areas of rare earth metals, transport, mechanical engineering and agriculture. All the interesting areas will be presented to the potential German investors. Moreover, we will present to them special conditions as well as provide platforms in our 10 special economic zones designed for the German investors. Специальные условия. То есть дадим площадки в наших специальных экономических зонах, а у нас 10 специальных экономических Именно зон. Для немецких Именно для немецких инвесторов. Meanwhile, the head of state noted that Kazakhstan adheres to its own model of public administration. Мы выстроили рыночную экономику по классификации doing business. We have built a market economy. According to the Doing Business Ranking, Kazakhstan has taken the 25th place in the world on ease of doing business. According to the classification of the World Economic Forum, we are ranked 55th in the world in terms of competitiveness. This means that our indicators constantly improve and in certain categories we are significantly ahead of most countries. Two thousand nineteen has been fruitful in strengthening cooperation between Kazakhstan and European Union. The EU Kazakhstan Friendship Group has been created for the first time in the European Parliament. The parties have spoken about this and other achievements at a meeting in Brussels on the eve of the Independence Day of Kazakhstan. Politicians highlighted the positive dynamic course of relations. The EU Special Representative for Central Asia, Peter Burian, noted Kazakhstan's sustainable growth, while the Kazakh ambassador to Belgium said that one of the important results of the year is the completion of the EU-Kazakhstan Enhanced Partnership and Cooperation Agreement ratification. This year was definitely a fruitful year for us. The most important event was the official visit of the chairperson of European Union, Donald Tusk, to Kazakhstan. Ratification of the EU-Kazakhstan Enhanced Partnership and Cooperation Agreement, signed in 2015, has been completed. The trade aspect of this agreement has entered into force. Currently, we are making preparations for a roadmap that will be used to implement this agreement. If we begin to actively implement this, it will open up big opportunities opportunities in various fields such as agriculture, trade, culture and education. First of all, I wanted to congratulate uh, Kazakh people uh, on 28th anniversary of independence and uh, it's really truly remarkable what happened within this very short historical uh, period of time. Many uh, countries are building their statehood and uh, independence for uh, centuries, but you managed to build it within a very short period of time. And uh, um, I'm pleased to know that uh, European Union has been a very strong partner for Kazakhstan since the early years of independence. And I believe also we contributed to the success story uh, of Kazakhstan by supporting your reforms, by supporting your modernization. Armenian entrepreneurs are looking for new areas of cooperation with Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan attracts the Eurasian Economic Union partner due to its huge market, favorable geographic location and convenience of doing business. The areas of opportunity for the cooperation were discussed at the Kazakhstan-Armenia Export Opportunities Forum recently. Representatives of governments and business sector as well as diplomats gathered at a roundtable session for the discussion. Армянских бизнесменов, которые не только будут 
импортировать. We are trying to attract Armenian businessmen who will not only import Kazakh products from Kazakhstan, but who will also invest in Kazakhstan by opening their businesses or subsidiaries in the country. At today's forum, we have a few men from Armenia who are operating successful businesses in various areas such as construction and food industry in Kazakhstan. There are a few participants who have expressed interest to open their offices in Kazakhstan. Experts said that it is necessary to improve human potential in order to strengthen the trade economic cooperation. The parties need specialists who know both markets and who are competent in law, finance and tax reporting. We are going to discuss not only the trade cooperation, but also the investment opportunities of both countries. Over the past 16 years, the investment cooperation between Kazakhstan and Armenia has been developing. Since 2003, Kazakhstan's investments in Armenia have amounted to more than 52 million US dollars. The Armenian investments in Kazakhstan have amounted to less than 2 million US dollars. In 2018, Kazakhstan and Armenia sold to each other various types of products and raw materials worth 13 million US dollars. On top of the growth of indicators, economists also noted on the diversification of the commodity exchange. Analysts said that the common EAEU market provides advantages that need to be used. Armenian entrepreneurs have identified several priority areas for cooperation with Kazakhstan in 2020, including areas such as IT, communications and construction. Kyrgyzstan has presented its five-year intermediate results as a member of the Eurasian Economic Union. The country has set positive dynamics of economic growth within the period. The growth figure is at 4%. Based on statistical data, the export value of Kyrgyz products to the EAEU member countries has increased to almost 500 million US dollars. The volume of export was doubled within the five years. The majority of the country's trade activities were made with Kazakhstan and Russia. It gave a new impetus for further development of our enterprises. New factories of textile production as well as shoes production have been opened during this time. Export of produced fabrics and manufactured goods increases every year. Producers of the country are offered to switch to the Eurasian platform of standardization and labeling of goods as soon as possible in order to promptly supply Kyrgyz goods to the member countries of EAEU. The interaction is quite deep. It should be noted that Kazakh business is actively involved in promotion of national interests, information of agenda in the union space. The Atta Mekin business community actively participates on the level of expert discussion of various initiatives within the digital agenda. There are 80 entities in the list of Kyrgyz enterprises that supply goods based on the EAEU standard. Analysts forecasted that the trend will continue, which means that the number of exporters will increase. A low-carbon development strategy will be introduced in Central Asia. The project will be implemented with the support of German Society for International Cooperation as part of the Paris Climate Agreement. The strategy will include several areas such as energy, infrastructure, transport, urban engineering, agriculture and others. Experts will study the greenhouse gas reduction potential on these categories as well as analyze the ways to effectively reduce carbon emissions in the atmosphere. In the first stage, as a strategy is expected to be developed in Kazakhstan, following which the experience will then be extended in other countries in the region. It is important both for Kazakhstan and Central Asia. The main task of our project is to promote the development of the low-carbon strategy for Kazakhstan until the end of the next year. It includes not only goals to reduce emissions of greenhouse gas, but also environmental and social goals, tools, implementation and investments plans. Political instruments, plan implementation and plan investments. 
The UN Green Climate Fund has invested 557 million US dollars in renewable energy projects in Kazakhstan. A working plan was discussed at an international seminar, which was held in Incheon, South Korea. The investments were used to build a solar power station with a capacity of 40 megawatts in Karagandi region. A loan of 16.7 million US dollars was also provided for the construction of a renewable energy facility in the village of Jangis Tobie in East Kazakhstan region. In total, the UN Green Climate Fund and the European Bank for Reconstruction and Development plan to implement another 11 renewable energy projects in Kazakhstan. 2019, we have now 124 projects approved uh, with a total energy sale coming amount around uh, 6 billion, so 5.6 billion to be more precise. And uh, we have uh, 95 uh, accredited entities. The Documental Company has introduced its new developments, the Isolu Artificial Intelligence Model and the Documental Office App. The new products were presented at the Documental Technology Conference in North Sultan. The intelligent virtual assistant Isolu will help users in making decisions. For example, it can advise to whom the users should send the particular document and who has previously dealt with this issue. Meanwhile, the Documentolog office will allow users to do all the work in one interface without needing to switch to other apps. The Documentolog Technology Conference was held for the second time. At this event, clients of the company shared their results taken from the effect of using process automation system using a domestic platform Documentolog. We have implemented 33 processes within one year and seven months of cooperation with Documentolog. Topics such as ensuring information security, international electronic documentation procedure, external services automation, correspondence with government agencies and many more were discussed at the conference. Representatives of more than 300 companies took part in the event. Today, more than 7,000 companies are using the Documentolog services. The 80th anniversary of Kazakh writer Abish Kekilbaev is celebrated in Nur Sultan. Participants of the International Scientific and Theoretical Conference highlighted the writer's influence on contemporary Kazakh literature as well as on national ideology and spirituality. Abish Kekilbaev wrote dozens of books, including novels and short stories, and he also translated the works of Shakespeare, Chekhov and Tolstoy into Kazakh language. His works have been translated into 13 different languages. Events dedicated to the anniversary of the public and political figure will be held throughout the country until the end of the year. He left his mark in cinema, theatrical art and Kazakh drama. He made a huge contribution to the formation of Kazakh literature, leaving the new generation an invaluable legacy. His name is recognized around the world and it definitely carries a special meaning for Kazakhs. With all due respect, he is a very unique person and a phenomenon himself in all aspects. We are happy that on the eve of the writer's anniversary, the people have once again showed their maturity. We have proven that we are able to pay tribute and be proud of outstanding figures of our nation. The 8th Bastau International Film Festival has been opened for students and debut films in Almata. Evaluation on feature films will be conducted for the first time in the competition. A total of 26 countries take part in this festival. We are here to help you to make this festival interesting and lively, to introduce you to each other and to watch the films. We have an incredible program of various master classes. Art director of the festival, Diana Ashimova, said that the program includes several international competitions. These are Bastau Shorts, where short films will be presented to the jury members. The second competition is the Bastau Debuts, which involves full-length movies.
задача жюри в этом смысле тоже в свою очередь немножко так это In this regard the task of the jury is to provide support and to some extent give a chance for the contestants to move further in their career and ensure that the cinematography will take place фигура в общем-то кинематографическая именно состоялась The feature films will be evaluated by international jury experts, including Russian film director Mikhail Segal, Spanish film critic Roberto Cueto, French producer Denis Vaslin, Russian actress Nelly Uvarova, as well as Kazakh actor and producer Farhat Abdraimov.